Hello, this is Arnold Carmona of EKG Rhythms. In this short blog, I will show you the difference between Wandering Atrial Pacemaker and Multifocal Atrial Rhythm. Strip A is an irregular rhythm with variable P wave shapes or morphology, irregular PP and RR interval, and variable PR interval. The YQRS beats labeled PVCs are actually aberrantly conducted beats. You will notice distinct P waves in V1, which is the second, uh, the, bot, uh, the, sec the bottom lead, the, the second lead in strip A. This is what you see in multifocal atrial rhythm. Strip B, on the other hand, is also irregular, but there is a gradual change in the shape of the P wave as you go from the left to the right. This is what you see in Wandering Atrial Pacemaker. Multifocal atrial rhythm or multifocal atrial tachycardia belongs to a, belong to a group of rhythm called multifocal atrial arrhythmia. The electrographic criteria for the diagnosis of MAA, which include both MAT and MAR, consists of variable P-wave morphology of at least three different shapes or configurations and irregular PP and PR interval. WAP, on the other hand, or Wandering Atrial Pacemaker, is a variant of sinus arrhythmia. It involves the passive transfer of a dominant pacemaker focus from the sinus node to, the, to a latent pacemaker. So what you see in the surface AKG is that change will occur in a gradual fashion. A wandering atrial pacemaker is difficult to catch on your regular 12 bleed, random 12 bleed EKG, and even on telemetry. I often say this when the patients are sleeping and you need to observe tele the telemetry strip for a longer period of time so that you can appreciate this, the gradual change of P-wave morphology. Thank you and have a good day.